Welcome to another episode in our series on COVID-19 Science in Context. I'm Stephen and joining me today is Dr Anne Corrie. What is the data showing about the spread of the Delta variant? So unfortunately, the Delta variant is growing fast and it has become um, the dominant variant in the UK. And this is due to a combination of two factors that are hard to disentangle. The first is uh, an increase in transmissibility and the second is a reduced uh, vaccine efficacy. So there is still uncertainty on how much more transmissible Delta is compared to Alpha. And there's also emerging evidence that uh, Delta might be more severe. Early studies suggest vaccines would still be relatively effective at preventing symptomatic infection uh, with Delta, but we don't know yet how much protection they would give against severe disease and death or against infection and infectiousness. What effect would we see if we continued to relax restrictions as planned? It's hard to predict what exactly would happen if restrictions are eased as planned on 21st of June. But we have used our model to explore a range of scenarios that capture these uncertainties as much as possible. And in all scenarios, we see a third wave happening. But with the current knowledge about Delta, we can't really predict the size of that wave. However, in all scenarios we've looked at, uh, delaying step four by a few weeks reduces the size of the wave. So delaying the easing also allows to accumulate more evidence about the characteristics of Delta. Um, and I hope in a few weeks, we would be in a better position to predict what the epidemic may look like in the next few weeks or months. Should the vaccine program be rolled out to people under 18? There are obvious ethical issues to consider, but from a population perspective, anything that reduces gaps in the population protection will help mitigate the epidemic. So expanding the eligibility criteria to younger individuals would indeed help. Having booster vaccines that are more effective in particular against new variants would also help. So yes, I think it is a strategy which should definitely be considered. Thanks for your time. Thank you.